How is it going, everybody? This is RBT coming at you with the videos that I love to make, which are my preseason NFL uh, videos, my predictions. And the reason I love doing them is because they're so easy to make for my NFL videos for preseason. I just make them very simple. I just list the standings and leave up, leave the discussion to you guys in the comment section below to just uh, let me know if you agree, disagree, what do you think the standings are going to be. So it's very simple. I'm going to make a video for each division, then another video for each conference, adding in the playoffs, and then one video for all of football um, with the uh, my Super Bowl pick in it. So that's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 videos I'm about to make here uh, in this little quick span of time. And this one's going to be longer than most because I'm uh, explaining everything in this video. So it's just going to be listing each team in the division, how I think it's going to finish, finish a record. And that's it. Discussions left up to you guys in the comment section below. And I'll probably reply to all your comments with stuff, I think, and everything. So let's uh, let's get started. Oh, before that, uh, the reason I'm doing this so quick, I forgot, actually, about my NFL predictions. And uh, I have, what, three days before the release of NCAA Football 14, for me at least, and I'm going to be making a ton of videos for that. I'm wanting my all my preview and prediction videos for the upcoming football season for college football and NFL uh, uploaded by that time. And that's uh, that's going to be hard for me to do because all these videos, I'm going to be uploading like two or three of these videos a day. Hopefully you guys will I'll be okay with that. And um, like I said, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos for NCAA football when it comes out. And that's all my channel is going to be for a while after the release. Um... And for the college football predictions, all I have left to do is the American Athletic Conference, the independent teams, and then all the non-BCS conferences, which is going to be in one video. So you're probably not watching that for this, and hopefully uh, you got through that because I'm going to go with the AFC East right now. And we're going to start from bottom to top. The Jets have them going 3-13. and They're just complete disarray in their... I even saw, uh, was looking online, um, researching a little bit for my predictions, even saw online a bunch of people thought they might go 0-16. So, Jets got them 3-13, Bills going 5-11, Dolphins 8-8. Eight eight. They've made some great transactions over the offseason. They look good on paper. See how they can do in the real season. Got them going 8-8. Eight eight. Got the New England Patriots going 11-5. Before everything that happened with Aaron Hernandez had to go 12-4, or actually 13-3. Uh, and then all that happened. So uh, with the question questionable health of Rob Mankowski and Aaron Hernandez not being the team anymore, uh, we have to see who the top two targets are going to be now. In lost Wes Welker, so we have to do how, see how the new receivers can do. But there you go. Patriots eleven and five. Dolphins eight and eight. Bills five and eleven. Jets three and thirteen. So let me know what you think about my picks in the comment section below. Have a great day, guys. Leave your standings in the comment section below. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. Have a great day, guys.